The Duke and Duchess of Sussex moved to the US after leaving the Frim in March 2020, and have only returned to the UK a handful of times since. However, Prince Harry was less than happy with the family being stripped of their security after stepping down. The Duke launched a legal battle with the Home Office over its refusal to grant the Sussexes police protection whilst visiting the UK. A former royal butler has urged the couple to take the high ground and not get involved with legal battles. Speaking on the popularity of the royal family on behalf of online casino.ca, Grant Harold said he is confused over the rise in legal proceedings from the royals. In the past few years the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have also launched legal proceedings against several British news outlets, including the BBC and associated newspaper Limited which owns the Daily Mail, Mail Online and the Mail on Sunday. Mr. Harold said his Rickley King and Queens did not ever get involved in legal battles. The former butler said, The only thing that sometimes confuses me is you see historically kings and queens did not ever get involved in legal battles or suing but there's been a lot of that going on, obviously with Harry and Meghan, the Prince and Princess of Wales. I think the Queen only ever twice did that but it's becoming more regular and that's sadly the world we live in. He recognized that the family want to protect the name and brand but urged them to think twice. Mr. Harold added, they want to protect the name and the brand but I get that, I really do, it's just royalty used to mean something quite different. I think it's important that they show they're just like you and me and they're not that different but I think going back to things that have happened recently, sometimes it's better to take the high ground and not get involved with things. Speaking on the new Prince and Princess of Wales Mr. Harold said they never put a foot wrong, comparing them to the late Queen and Prince Philip. He continued, two very similar couples. Very similar love, very similar dedication to duty but two very different types of royals, one very traditional and one very modern, and that's part of this transition. He also credited Prince William and Prince Harry for putting their differences aside out of the love for their grandmother following the death of Queen Elizabeth II in September. Commenting on the brothers joined the prince during the mourning period he said, that was genuine that was out of love for their grandmother. It was really nice to see that. I was really glad to see them as one family again, 